welcome back to my channel. My name is Victoria Rose. I say welcome back because I don't really get new people here often. You new here? If you're new here, leave a comment or you don't have to. Just don't. Uh, welcome. That's all. <laughs> Anyways, I want to do an intro for this video because I didn't have an introduction for it, but today we are going to explore the Love Museum and a coconut box in Korea. Um, the reason that I didn't have an intro because I didn't know what we were doing. We were trying to find the Trick Eye Museum, which is a museum that has a lot of cool like not Trick Eye illusion type of things, but we wandered everywhere. We couldn't actually find it. It's there, I know, but we weren't very good with directions. So my friend and I, Bonnie, we stumbled into this other place called the Coconut Box. We, we were wandering around looking for the Trick Eye Illusion Museum. We couldn't find it, which is a very interesting concept. So you go in and they give you a little, tiny little bit of like champagne. You get an hour and a half. It was like under $20. There's different, but we we're in bungalows right now. We're, they gave us champagne. Um, they, we have a ball pit, okay? And you have this whole area of like, little huts and there's sand and there's ball pits and it's kind of like a rest area. I don't really know how to describe it because they don't have things like this in America. It's like, um, well, let me just show you. How deep is this? <laughs> oh! <gasps> Ready? really nice under here. I'm gonna do the backstroke. Wow, it's, it's, it's a nice little escape under there. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Wait, are we allowed to slide down this? Yeah. <laughs> okay. I love that this is for adults. And then there's, no, there's no kids. It just looks very steep from here. Oh, this looks dangerous. I know. It feels dangerous. You're fine, right? Yeah, you're fine. You're durable. <laughs> well, this is kind of scary. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, there's a mat down here. <laughs> oh, this is so cool. I wish I didn't have a skirt on. I'm coming. <laughs> <laughs> it's just trying to be modest. <laughs> Go. <laughs> yes. Okay, so we conquered the ball pit. There's another ball pit, actually. Welcome to the coconut box. I realized we actually did find the Trick Eye Museum. It was just the Love Museum as well. So it was like an optical illusions thing, but love themed. When you walk in, you're greeted with a huge ball pit. There's free bananas. We came on a Monday night and it was so empty. It was basically to ourselves. You have free bananas here. They have so many different bungalows to choose from. You see a ton of little bungalows that you can choose from to stay in with Bluetooth speakers. They have sandals that you put on. There's sand and you're allowed to rest or do whatever you want. You just leave your stuff in the bungalow and go explore. If you want to go on a vacation in the middle of Seoul, like, this is so cool. I've never experienced anything like this place before. Oh, we should have chosen this room. There's a record player. We tried to choose our room, but it was like choosing an apartment to stay in. Oh, well, there's, a, there's a naked lady right there. <laughs> yeah, I'm really cold down here. Can you let me up on that? There's no space, there's no room. I know, I'm bad with your commitment issues. going on? Oh, we have to see the Love Museum. I wonder if we only have an hour and a half for everything, probably. We also have to go in the media box. We have a lot to do on our hour and a half vacation. A reality show now, and it's time for elimination round. Bonnie, I just have to say, you didn't live up to your potential. 
You are floated on you really, She didn't live up to her potential, I agree. So. <laughs> to say my friend and I's favorite spot in this place was the media art place. It was amazing. Like we spent the most time in there just dancing and nobody was there. So we just danced and danced. These moments are what makes all the traveling worth it. unfortunately leave the island we had to go look at boobs like that media room was in amazing connected to that which you may have heard of is the love museum in Seoul which is very um, I can't show most of the things in this video that were in it but I'm going to do my best to kind of make it you know the PG 13 version <laughs> There's a banana I'll just cover up this top right here we're just having a not an innocent Oh God, <laughs> an innocent time here, but it is dirty, dirty. This makes me uncomfy. <laughs> Which I didn't plan on going to the Love Museum, but we were there, so why not? Up. Oh, sorry. Yeah, okay, this okay, is YouTuber no. talking about. I'm sure, there's a bunch of porn going on in the background though. <laughs> Don't get Ooh la la! <laughs> I'm so happy finally. <laughs> The Harry Potter cafe bar. Gracias. Here, I'll taste this. I don't think we go up these stairs. How do we go upstairs? Do we go in there? Next, we decided to pop into the Harry Potter bar that is in Hongdae, and it's pretty close to try out their butter beer and just look around. A mirror! <laughs> Oh, thanks for telling me that because I've yeah. never watched her. Yeah. I'm a poser right now. So we're we're in the <laughs> Harry Potter uh, cafe. So if you guys are Harry Potter fans, like you'll know what all this stuff is, but I don't. Oh, let's take the elevator, yeah? Do you want to? Do well, you want to? We only go up one floor. All right, go ahead. I'm just what trying, if I drop it? I'm just trying to be hopeful. And again, this is Monday night, so it was all really empty. I don't know. Oh, that's what you're supposed to do here. I don't even know if I'm in the shot. It doesn't look like I am. <laughs> so, yeah. Right? It tastes it's like pretty good. It's tastes like good. butter beer. It tastes kind of like a. I like it. It's almost like a root beer float. Yeah, except real beer. Yeah. But butter beer. We give it a seven to eight out of ten. It's pretty good. This floor has those. It almost feels like a knockoff. Cool. Look, there's actual like actual candles. Uh, I really like them. And there's nobody up here. Like they're not fake. Look at the, how the wax is built up. Like nobody's even up here and like <laughs> they have like real fire ha fire hazard candles. <laughs> <laughs> like look at the shrine over here. Like Oh, this is cool. <laughs> Hello. Good morning. Yesterday I had a ton of fun. 
uh, did a lot of things. I didn't even realize that we we're gonna do all those things. But yeah, that was really fun and it wasn't even that expensive for all those things. This video is kind of random because I didn't know what we were doing in it, but I hope you enjoyed it nonetheless. Thank you for coming along with me. I am going incognito right now. I'm going out to get some, um, something to eat at a convenience store in the rain. And this is, this is the, my down day where I just kind of edit today and rest and stretch. So I don't do anything. So I just hide myself. This is my outfit of the day. Stay tuned for more videos. Thank you as always for being here. Stay extraterrestrial and I'll see you next.